Traditionally, the hiring process involves three steps, filling out an application, acing an interview, and training for your newly acquired job. But nowadays, many applicants, like 18-year-old Dejan Cross, aren't making it past the first step. So none of the jobs hit me up, and some of them I didn't fill it out like two, three months ago. And I call them, and they'll say that, you know, we only check out applications once a month. Cross's difficulty finding work now compounded by a new statewide record for unemployment. It took a tremendous leap uh, in the month of May to 8.5%. Uh, and. Um, the largest single month jump in uh, nearly 25 years. While the jump is substantial, the CEO says it's too soon to be alarmed. According to Sykes, May is a month known for record unemployment as youngsters enter the workforce looking, but oftentimes not finding summer work. If they can find jobs, they become the unemployed, so it, it tends to affect uh, data you know, that, that affects all the labor market data that month. Uh, in this case, we suspect that lots of them entered and didn't find employment and caused this real volatility. Stites says he'll have a better understanding of what the record increase really means when June figures are released next week. Until then, he has a few strong words of advice for Michigan job seekers. You know, hire me because I'm a good worker. I'm a people person. You know, I can show up on time. Those don't mean anything. You better have something that's out there that really matches up with the sectors of the economy that are growing that are in demand. If hired, Cross has some advice of his own he plans to follow. You got that job, be there every day you can, on time, every day. But work even extra if you, if you got to. In Lansing, Sedra Mayfield, Home TV.